one of our signature projects in the, um, in the Institute is looking at the pathology and the cause of a condition or disease called Langerhans cell histiocytosis, also called LCH for short. It's a disease um, that affects children as well as adults, but predominantly children. And it's a relatively uncommon um, condition where there's tumour-like masses forming in organs throughout the body. If you have a um, Langerhans cells that, that are in a uh, tissue and you have the immune cells coming around to get rid of that uh, uh, Langerhans cell, then you may develop a, a, almost a tumour or a large amount of uh, inflammatory cells. Those inflammatory cells can grow to quite significant sizes and that's why it's almost considered to be like a tumour. We may be able to understand what triggers the disease and by understanding what triggers the disease we may be able to uh, treat the disease better for patients who have got the more advanced form of the disease and perhaps finding this information about the immune system may allow us to treat other cancers and other uh, disorders, um, including inflammatory disorders, a bit better. Our team has discovered um, a new immune cell that's um, present in all cases of Langerhans cell histiocytosis, not previously discovered in any other disease. Um, we are now in the process of better uh, understanding what these cells do and our research team here in collaboration with with um, overseas um, collaborators are looking at how we can um, understand the function of these cells and we have a collaboration with a team in Melbourne which is also looking at um, these, these cells in a way of trying to understand what role they play in Langerhans cell histiocytosis. I'd like to uh, introduce Professor Yang Inge Hinter from the Karolinska Institute in Stockholm, who's one of our collaborators uh, on, in the Langerhans cell histiocytosis project and is the visiting John Turner cancer research professor who's currently visiting the laboratories in, uh, at the Fiano Alsi Cancer Research Institute. Uh, welcome to the Institute, uh, Yang Inge. Thank you, George. So to us, it's a great pleasure to collaborate with uh, Professor Kanorakis and the group here in Ballarat uh, because they have the same view of the disease as us, that there is a trigger triggering this uh, disease. And we really want to understand what is the underlying cause. And, and in order to do that, we can then study the cells that are, uh, that are elevated and expressed in this, in this disease and, and trying to understand the underlying cause of the disease and by doing so we can do th two things first of all we can hopefully find a rational cure for the disease by knowing the, the cause of the disease and second maybe reveal a new human biology because if there is a new trigger that is unknown that may explain other things in human biology as well um, we are looking forward to uh, maintaining our close ties and I think some of our researchers that are currently working in this area have interacted with some of uh, Professor Henter's group as well and that has been a very fruitful collaboration.